the biggest part about fighting is the mental game. Oh, great question. Yes, the mental game. Got to be mentally strong. Um, you know, that side I've always failed on because of my background, I guess, you know. You know, you're afraid to hurt people. You're afraid to take that leap. Even remembering when the first time my coaches were saying, hey, you should be a fighter. And I'm like, oh, no, dude, I shouldn't be a fighter. I, I, I just want to train. But if you don't have that mental uh, killer instinct, they call it, you know, it, it won't serve you good. And it's scary, man. It's, it's scary. A lot of people don't understand that, you know. And I know Gegard, he has a killer instinct, you know. He's he's fighting for some. We're all fighting for some. So I expect him to come at me full blast. And uh, that's cool. Because I've, I realize since I don't have that, I got something else. You know, I'm not just fighting for me. I'm fighting for a lot of kids who got picked on. Because I do my anti-bullying stuff. You know, the shit that you don't see on TV. I go to schools. Talk to kids. Because I was there, I didn't have anybody. So I know it feels good to go there. And that one kid in that room could hear me talking and say, Hey man, you can't quit. When the world wants you to quit, you can't. When they want you to give up, you can't. You still got to press on. That's the shit I do. What do you do? Lost a lot of confidence when you got rolled up by your opponent. <laughs> um, it does mess with your head. But like I said, you only lose when you accept defeat. Just go out there, have some fun. Don't worry about the crowd. Don't worry about what people got to say. People are going to love you. People are going to hate you. It's a part of life. One of the best advice I've got when I was a kid, when I said, you know what? I'm going to change the world. And my sensei was like, son, it's going to be hard to do that. But that man in the mirror, that's easy. You can change that man anytime. So as long as you focus on your goal, as long as you know what you want. And yeah, you know what? You're going to fail sometimes. But failure is good. Failure will either remind you, hey, I'm not focused on my goal hard enough or fuck how bad do I want it or am I gonna quit that's what failure does failure is a lesson and who gives a fuck if someone doesn't like you you think someone's opinion of you is gonna run your life if you allow someone's opinion of you to run your life then you're a loser you're a natural born loser we're all different man not everyone's gonna like you it took me a while to realize that because the way I was brought up was to do the right thing most of the time but not everyone's gonna like you and like C.T. Fletcher says, fuck them. Who gives a fuck what they got to say? Fuck them. When they step in the ring and do what I do, then they could, but they don't understand. So my advice, fuck them.